Have you ever wondered if there's a moment in your life when you might see Our Lady? Or maybe you've thought about the possibility of capturing Our Lady, or even Jesus on camera. Believe it or not, some people say they have. There are stories of people not only seeing them but even recording their voices. These voices sound unlike anything else some describe them as soft and comforting, while others say they feel an odd chill or even a bit scared when they hear them. Imagine hearing a voice that feels like it's coming from another world, a voice so different from anything we know. Could it be possible to capture such a powerful, divine presence on film or audio? These experiences leave people with questions and a deep sense of wonder. To ensure many people watch this video, please share it with others and subscribe to our channel. We hope this message touches your heart and helps you come closer to understanding souls and assisting people in changing for the better. If you agree, please type. Amen. It was a chilly evening in the small town, where twilight was settling in and people were finishing their day. The streets were unusually empty, save for a few lingering townsfolk heading home. But then, something curious caught the attention of a young couple walking along the main road. There, on the corner of a busy intersection, sat an unfamiliar beggar. Clothed in a worn, faded cloak, he looked like he had seen many hardships, his head bowed and hands resting in his lap. But what made him different, and what stopped people in their tracks, was the glow surrounding him a faint, radiant light that seemed to pulse softly, almost like a heartbeat. At first, only a few people noticed the strange glow. They whispered to each other, puzzled and hesitant, trying to understand if their eyes were playing tricks in the dim light. But as more people gathered around, the glow became undeniable. The light was real, hovering around the beggar, casting gentle colors that shifted between pale yellows, soft blues, and even faint purples. People began taking out their phones to snap photos and record videos, unable to resist capturing such an unusual sight. As the minutes turned into hours, more people joined the growing crowd. It was as though an invisible force had drawn them to this spot compelling them to watch this mysterious figure. Some people felt comforted by the light. Others felt a strange, overwhelming sense of peace wash over them. Elderly folks in the crowd clasped their hands, their eyes misty, as if remembering something sacred from long ago. Children gazed up in awe, drawn to the gentle glow like moths to a flame. But as the crowd grew, so did the mystery. Nobody knew who this beggar was, and despite the cold, he showed no sign of shivering. The chill of the night seemed to fade in his presence, replaced by a warmth that made people feel as though they were standing near a hearth. Curious murmurs spread through the crowd, with some suggesting that this was no ordinary beggar but perhaps a wandering holy person, or even an angel in disguise. Yet, no one dared to approach him too closely, feeling that they were in the presence of something sacred. Then, as the clock approached midnight, something miraculous began to unfold. The beggar slowly lifted his head, and the glow surrounding him grew brighter, taking on an almost golden hue that bathed the entire street in a heavenly light. Gasps filled the air as his appearance began to change before their eyes. The ragged cloak he wore started to shimmer, transforming into a flowing, radiant robe that seemed woven from stardust itself. His face softened, his features became graceful and pure, and his form grew taller, more majestic. People watched, eyes wide, as the beggar transformed into a figure so beautiful, so filled with peace, that some of them fell to their knees, overwhelmed by what they were witnessing. The beggar's form had become that of a woman, her face serene and gentle, her hands raised as though in a blessing. She looked out over the crowd with eyes full of compassion and love Our Lady, standing on the street corner, as real as any of them, but glowing with an otherworldly radiance. A reverent silence fell over the crowd as they gazed upon her. She said nothing, but her presence filled the air with a feeling of deep peace, a love so profound it was almost overwhelming. Some felt as though she was comforting them, lifting burdens they had carried for years. Others felt her eyes meet theirs, as though she understood every sorrow, every hope, every unspoken prayer in their hearts. The cameras and phones that had captured the transformation continued to roll, 
documenting every second of the miraculous event. And then, without warning, another figure appeared beside her, stepping into the glow of her light. He was taller, and his expression was both humble and powerful, with a strength that radiated compassion and peace. People in the crowd gasped, recognizing him from sacred art and stories passed down through generations Jesus, standing beside Our Lady, his hand resting gently on her shoulder as they looked upon the gathering with boundless love. The two figures stood together, their presence filling the street with a sense of unity and hope. Their silent gaze seemed to reach each person individually, as though delivering a message tailored to every heart. Some felt an unspoken encouragement to forgive old wounds, others felt inspired to be kinder and more compassionate. A gentle warmth spread through the crowd, like sunlight breaking through clouds, melting away doubts and fears. For those who were lucky enough to witness the event, time felt as though it had stopped. The night's chill was forgotten, replaced by a feeling of warmth and comfort that seemed to sink into the very stones of the street. A mother holding her young child felt tears streaming down her face, not from sadness but from a deep joy she could barely describe. An elderly man whispered prayers, his hands shaking as he held his rosary, his faith renewed in a way he had never thought possible. Then, slowly, Our Lady and Jesus turned to each other, as though sharing a silent conversation, a connection so deep it needed no words. With one last gentle gaze upon the crowd, they began to fade, their figures becoming translucent, shimmering softly until they were but a memory of light. The golden glow lingered a moment longer before it too faded, leaving the street bathed in the quiet darkness of the night. The townspeople remained in stunned silence, feeling a sense of awe that no words could capture. Slowly, they began to disperse, still holding on to the warmth and peace that had touched their hearts. Those who had captured the miraculous event on camera would later share it with the world, showing others the unexplainable encounter they had witnessed a reminder that miracles still happen, that divine grace sometimes appears in the most unexpected places, and that love and hope endure even in the quiet corners of our lives. The story of that night spread quickly, and people from all over began to visit the small town, hoping to feel a glimpse of the peace and love that Our Lady and Jesus had left behind. The street corner became a place of quiet pilgrimage, a symbol of the holy encounter that had transformed an ordinary evening into a moment of timeless grace. Thank you for watching till the end of our video. Our brothers and sisters, without fear and with more faith than in the past, let us continue in faith. Stay blessed and continue to pray for God to show all of us his graces and blessings. God bless us and protect us. Amen.